Amok. A for Ancient. Traditionally speaking, the Rosicrucian order dates back to the mystery schools of ancient Egypt. Historically speaking, it appeared in the 17th century with the publication of three manifestos, the Pharma Fraternitatis, the Confessio Fraternitatis, and the Chemical Wedding of Christian Rosencroats, published in 1614, 1615, and 1616 respectively. In 2001, Amorc published the Positio Fraternitatis Rosae Crucis, a treatise that some esoteric historians consider to be the fourth Rosicrucian manifesto. M for mystical. Amorc is a mystical movement in the sense that it perpetuates teachings that cover the mysteries of the universe, of nature and of humanity itself. Devoid of all dogma, the aim of these teachings is to increase self-awareness and improve understanding of the profound meaning of existence. Today, they are presented in the form of booklets that each member receives at home or to which he has access via the internet. Those seeking it may also receive training by attending lectures at a lodge. O for order. When applied to Amok, the word order has no religious connotations. It refers to the fact that its members form a true fraternity. It was once considered quite rightly to be a secret society, as this was necessary in order to protect itself from religious and political persecution. Today, Amok is a discreet movement that brings together men and women of all races, nationalities, religions and social classes. Its motto is the greatest tolerance within the strictest independence. R for Rosé. To the members of Amok, the rose symbolizes the human soul. From a rosy crucian point of view, it is pure and perfect in essence, and all individuals evolve under its guidance, even if they are not objectively aware of it. Our existence on Earth is precisely in order to raise our awareness of the special wisdom of the soul and to express this through our behavior. Because such an objective cannot be attained in one life only, most Rosicrucians accept the principle of reincarnation. C for Crucis. The cross used by Amorc has no Christian connotations. It represents the physical body and is the image of a cross formed when we are standing up, our arms outstretched horizontally and our legs pressed together. With the rose placed in its center, it represents the duality of all human beings and the fact that each one of us is both body and soul. This naturally presupposes having a spiritual conception of life and accepting that life is not limited to the material world. In every country in which it is present, the ancient and mystical order Rosi Crucis is considered to be a non-religious, non-political, philosophical movement open to all men and women in search of well-being, knowledge and wisdom.